Hey, everybody. Welcome back to Jersey Boys Outdoors. This is our August 15th fishing report for the Jersey Shore. Don't forget, guys, that we have our August fluke contest going on right now. John Me is in the lead with a 25 and a half inch fluke. So uh, if you catch something bigger than that, uh, send it in. If you catch something smaller, still send it. We'd love to report <laughs> about the fish you guys are catching and what's going out there, uh, what's going on on the water. Right That's right. Now. And make sure if you send it in, don't be like uh, somebody you'll see when Isaac's report today. Make sure it looks like John's picture here, clearly marked out on the tape measure that we can see exactly how big it is uh and that's how you're entering the contest and it's uh free of charge so it's, it. you know it doesn't hurt you to enter in and is that, is that all we got yep oh boy all right this is could be a short year for you guys all right we got <laughs> it's Ro- that time of year it is it is it's says dog days of august uh we got rose and pete were out on the great bay when they were uh, able to pick up three fluke using squid and killies which is a wise decision because of all those croakers out there uh, the largest was this 20 incher caught by Rose using a Rose rig, which is a Pompano rig put on backwards. Uh, the weight is at the top of the rig instead of the bottom. Uh, Pete said this is something his wife did one day when they were catching when they weren't catching anything, and she's been catching fluke on it ever since. So I mean, hey, listen, you know hey, the the fluke don't know which way so. that's supposed yeah. to, <laughs> to look out there. As long as it catches fish, I mean, fish it, man. Uh, Fred Jarmella was fishing near the AC jetty using green crab when he was able to land this nice 23 incher and he was out on a boat and he wanted, uh, we didn't specify that not on the jetty. He's fishing on a boat near the jetty. Uh, and finally I have Jason from ski fish and enjoy life, uh, from YouTube. He was out fishing with his wife in the long branch Monmouth area. Uh, when they were able to pick up the trifecta, they landed a keeper fluke, a nice 25 inch striper and a blue fish. Jason said all the bites were right in the white water. And once the sun came up, the bite shut off and everything was caught on SP minnows. All right. I have Brian Keating. He went out on a boat in Belmar. They were fishing in 45 to 80 feet of water off uh, North Jersey between Asbury Park and the Highlands. He said it was a slow day, but the fish they caught were quality fish ranging from 22 uh, and 7 eighths inch to 20. A five and an eighth. You don't normally get eighth inch increments. In no, that's, that's, a, that's yeah. that we are. <laughs> but that's good. Hey, I, like, I like accuracy there. So that's thank right. you for sending that in. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Captain Andy shared this report from Mac and his crew. They were offshore fishing for tuna and mahi mahi. And there's my phone. I, you know, I almost said to you before we started, yeah. hey, you should really mute your phone because I know you never do. But I, I, yeah, you should be more trying. like me. I just, my phone's always on the vibrate. You know, you just don't. Who needs a ringer uh, anymore? You know, I, who does I, that? I used but, to do that, but I like the ringer now. All right. Let's just, let's just uh, cut. Keep going. <laughs> Back to it. <laughs> All right. Here I have Captain Andy. Uh, he shared this report from Mac and his crew who were um, offshore fishing for tuna and mahi mahi. Uh, looks like they had a fun, successful trip. And if you need any bait and tackle for your next trip, stop in and see Captain Andy at Riptide Bait and Tackle. He'll set you up with everything you need. Dave Minnick was fishing the surf in Surf City when he was able to land this nice fluke in a small blue. And finally, I have John Guile. Uh, who was in the Great Bay using minnows when he landed this 19-inch fluke? John also said the croakers are still there. Now I don't have a picture. Um, is that my phone again? <laughs> oh, man, the second time one video must be an important phone call. <laughs> oh, there's third time. All right, this is fairly really important. So we're uh, we'll be right back with up. you. Like I said, John got he got this <laughs> fluke in the Great Bay. Uh, I don't have a picture because. He was by himself, and he sent me a short video that was just the worst quality. Maybe we'll throw it in. But, John, we got to get you some help with your photography. Hey, so. but listen, at least, at least his foot wasn't being it he wasn't actually, food, he, but yeah. he used legit tape measure this time. No, so. there was no tape measure. Well, I was on the, on the boat. Oh, I mean, on the boat. You're right. Yeah, right. like yeah, it was, yeah, you, know, right. we, you know, it was something. Yeah, it's, that's, right. it's a proof it somewhat. Just it the, is. Uh, We're getting there. So, yeah. John, thank you for sending that uh, in. And, uh, yeah, we appreciate it. Guys, if you're on the water, <laughs> what a wreck. Guys, you get on the water, make sure you send us your reports. Love to see what you're catching. Uh, Good luck, guys. Good luck, everybody.